Welcome and thanks for tuning in. My name is Rob Kistner and I'm the president of the Digital Arts Experience. And today we're going to talk about a very useful and frequently underused feature of Evernote. Now, if you've never used Evernote, I suggest you visit our website at www.thedae.com and register for one of our Evernote workshops. Now today we're going to be talking about a feature in Evernote called encrypting text, which is going to allow you to password protect the information contained within a note. Now this is particularly useful because you can use Evernote to store your email address and passwords, your online banking login information, or any other website that requires you to log in. Let's take a look at how this works. I'm going to open up Evernote. And you'll notice in the left side, I've got a notebook already set up called Usernames and Passwords. If you haven't already set up a notebook called Usernames and Passwords, you can come on down to the bottom left corner of the screen and select this plus sign. This is going to give you an option to create a new notebook. Now, let's add our first username and password. So I'm going to come over here to the toolbar and select New Note, and Evernote will create an untitled note within my usernames and passwords notebook. I'm going to come over to the note title and select Gmail. I'm now going to enter my email address that I would use to log into Gmail, and my password. The DAE is the best. Now, you may be asking yourself, if someone is sitting in front of my computer and opens up Evernote, they'll be able to see all of my usernames and passwords. Well, that's where encrypting text comes in. All you need to do to protect this information is highlight the text and slide up to the edit menu at the top of the screen. And in the edit menu, there's an option that says encrypt selected text. So I'm going to select that option. And this box that says choose an encryption passphrase is going to pop up. And this is where I'm going to enter a password. Now this can be any password of your choice. This is the password that's going to be used to unlock this information. So I've entered my password, I hit OK, and all of a sudden the text is gone. And all you have is this box with a bunch of dots and a little arrow pointing downwards. This text is now password protected and only I can access it with this passcode. I'm going to create another note. And I'm going to enter in this note, Bank of America. And I'm going to put my login information for Bank of America. And once again, I'm going to highlight the text, slide up to the edit menu, and select Encrypt Selected Text. Now this is really important. I'm going to enter the same exact password that I used to lock my Gmail note. The reason being is once I add all of my email addresses, all of my usernames and passwords, and even my credit card numbers into this notebook, I can unlock any of the information with a single password. So now, rather than having to try and remember 5, 10, 12, 15, 20, 30 passwords, all I need to do is remember one because this one password will unlock all of my information. So if down the line I can't remember my Gmail information, all I need to do is come to Evernote and select my Gmail note, click on the little arrow pointing downwards, and select Show Encrypted Text. And all I have to do is enter that password that I used. Oops, I typed it in wrong. Let's try it again. And all of a sudden my information is unlocked. And as soon as I click off of that text, it relocks immediately so my information will always be safe. Now if you have any other questions on encrypting text in Evernote or any questions at all, please feel free to contact us at info at thedae.com or to view our workshops, classes, and one-on-one -on -one topics, please visit www.thedae.com. Thanks so much for tuning in.